All right, so my Pixel 9 Pro came in, finally. This is the smaller version of the 9 Pro. This is not the 9 Pro XL, so that's why it took a little longer to come in, but we finally have it. And this is an upgrade over my Pixel 8 Pro that I had from last year. I wasn't planning on upgrading, but I saw that they were releasing a smaller Pro model, and I was like, you know what? I wanna try and go for something a little smaller this time. Now, I did un unintentionally do a drop test right here. <laughs> When I opened the box up, it fell straight onto a vent. So uh, if you you know if you want to see a drop test test of the actual packaging, there you go. That's it did pretty decently, I'd say. But let's go ahead and start the unboxing. My first actual physical impression of this phone is it's very solid. It's very solidly built, very sleek. And that, that camera visor, I just, I love it. Looks so good. It's also noticeably smaller than my 8 Pro. That's a pretty decent bit smaller, that's nice. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and get it set up and yeah, see how it does. All right, it is now two days later and I've been using the 9 Pro as my main phone. And this is an absolutely wonderful device. Obviously it's only been two days, so I don't really have all the information to give you, but I can say for sure that this is a very, very solid phone, at least from what I've used. The build quality is phenomenal. Everything just feels really solid and very thought out. And the color, the hazel color just looks awesome like yeah i think it's the best color i'm not gonna lie i'll have some more detailed information about my usage on this phone after maybe a week or two or more but for now this is just first impressions and i really just think that this phone is a really nice step up from the 8 pro both in terms of size and just overall feeling of using the phone it just feels very premium and of course it definitely helps that we have this faster fingerprint sensor to go with, along with the you know other hardware improvements i think that's one of the more notable improvements i mean it's not like the 8 pro is bad by any means but you just had to approach it differently than you do in this one and this one will change entirely how you use a fingerprint sensor so i think it, it's really a really good fingerprint sensor and it's worth considering when you're going to be upgrading also don't worry i'm not going caseless on this phone i'm, I'm putting a case on it so don't, don't you worry i'm using the caseology parallax for now but i do plan on getting the official google case i might do a review on that too anyways yeah i i do really like this phone so far once i have more time with it i'll do a more longer in-depth video on it so don't you worry about that anyways i I hope you guys enjoyed this first impressions or unboxing video and hope you guys come back when i do a full detailed video on it anyways thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye bye thank you for watching